Hello, my name is Sherry Roselle and I'm a teacher at Mason County Central's Upper Elementary. And I'm here with my wonderful professional golf caddy, Tom Richard. Hi, Sherry. Hi. So nice to see you. Most people know me as Tom Richard, drama director, forensics coach extraordinaire. Part-time teacher, actually. I'm just a part-time teacher. The truth of the matter is, I'm Tom Richard, the professional caddy. That's what I do. I've caddied all around the world, actually. I, I enjoyed that. That was fun. So I... As you can see, Mr. Richard, professional golf caddy, really likes to chat. And that's our job today, is we're going to tour the Lakeside Links Golf Course with the MCC Education Foundation. And we are going to help you understand a little bit about the Golf Classic and ways that you can be involved for next year. Now, how I'm going to help today is I'm going to get right in the players' faces, real close. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show them how to set a target of success. I'm going to show them how to be the best they can be, just like I do when I'm part-time in the classroom. All right. We are going to have fun. How can you not have fun with this guy here? I'm pretty excited to um, take this adventure with, with Tom, professional golf caddy. Okay, so here we have some authentic rubber ducks from the late Scottville Harvest Festival River Duck Drop. So you're going to go ahead and reach in there and pick the lucky duck. I hope so. Nice I don't I don't know if I'd pick that one. Loser, winner, umbrella? Oh my goodness, you are the winner of an umbrella. How does it feel to win an umbrella and to touch an authentic river duck? It feels amazing. It feels amazing. I feel like I can be uh, protected from the rain and from the sun, uh, you know, any day. So it's awesome. Thank you. Perfect. That's wonderful. Now, I hope it doesn't rain or anything today, but maybe you could use it in the near future. Thank you. All right. We are here with Jeff Mount, superintendent of Mason County Central Schools. And we have a few questions that we're going to ask him about the MCC Education Foundation. So, Mr. Mount, what's new with the MCC Foundation this year? Oh, new stuff. Uh, well, you know, I got to start with the old, but we always put a new polish on the on the old. So the community auction north to Alaska is a great theme. We have smoked salmon coming. So those of you who love uh, salmon are going to love that. But, uh, you know, the theme is awesome too. But uh, we are also changing some of our focus and how we fund uh, different things. So we're looking for big projects and we've already got some coming in from our staff. And uh, so while we do some mini grants and stuff, we're going to do more of the big and we're looking for big projects. So uh, some really cool stuff coming up on that one. And that's what we're here to fundraise for and we're going to be spending some money on uh, our robotics program we're going to be spending some money on our uh, our security and so if you just saw the the, new, the rifle raffle sorry you missed out it sold out uh, 300 you bought one I bought my ticket I cannot wait <laughs> yes and so hopefully she wins because if she wins I win because we're on the same sheet uh, but you know, yeah yeah we got to go so those you know that right there made six thousand dollars for school safety so all these things all these fundraisers all go toward a good cause and protecting our kids but also providing quality education for too. We're here with Mr. Ben Nelson. He is be, he has been a participant in the Golf Classic for 28 years, so he's only missed one year. Mr. Nelson, can you tell us why you missed that for that year? We went to the uh, Wisconsin UNLV game in Las Vegas in 2007. It's the only I, time we missed. <laughs> I think that was a pretty good reason to miss the Classic. Now, Mr. Nelson, you have here something very interesting, and it looks like it's pretty important to the Golf Classic. Can you tell us a little bit about what this is and why you might have it today? Uh, this is Joe Camel, and he was our whole guy for on, on LaSalle Link. And he's been at every single one of these tournaments. Approaching the hot dog station where participants can come and help themselves to a delicious hot dog with all the fixings. And I want to draw your attention to my professional golf caddy, the guy that's in charge of carrying me around all day in the golf cart and also helping our golfers and making sure that they have the best pointers and ICs already up to no good. You must have fuel to play effectively. And this is the nectar of the gods. Hot dogs and nectar of the gods. All right. This is going to be exciting. Stay with us. 
How many hot dogs did you have? Two. How many hot dogs? I had did two, you and have? I gave him one. Oh, yeah. about twelve in there. Help me point needs a little help. He has a little back problem. Um, I'm going to give him a little advice real quick. <laughs> Mr. Mount. You rubbing that off on me? Hopefully that doesn't give you a bad game. Detroit let Lions see. though? Yeah, let me see how your back is today. Right there. Right there. Right there? Right there. Yeah. Okay, Alright, I'm good. Let's start it. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> uh, Seattle, can we keep it down? Are you ready, Mr. Bearwolf? I am I'm, I'm trying to make sure. Thank you. Okay. Uh Okay, they're ready. Cinderella story out of nowhere. Defending champions, they've got bragging rights on the line. We've got this is son, this is father. we have Dean Raven here, we have Don Thomas over here, and we're going to be following closely with this team. So you guys, do you have any last words before you start? What are you hoping to have happen today? What are some things that you're going to work together to do today on this green? Tell us a little bit about what you need to do to accomplish this, this task. Dean, I'm going to pick on you here because you haven't been on camera yet. What do you hope to accomplish today? Well, really, it's just uh, winning back-to-back -back titles. You know, last year, Team LaSalle took home the title, and we just have to duplicate it. Let me just uh, help out here for men, boys. This could be the longest putt. I know some of these players. 54, 54 inches. It could be the longest putt. 54 inches they're going for. Uh, you know, Sherry, I think we did very well today. We did the best we could, uh, considering uh, uh, the, uh, the level of professionalism that we're working with today, they, uh, you know, they had some rough holes there. And uh, the the highlight for me was watching uh, a ball skim across the water like a rock. That you just can't you can't teach that. That that comes from down deep. Um, I think my job will be to continue to nurture all day long, right into the stake. Okay. <laughs> I think they're going to need you, Tom. And, and on behalf of the MCC Education Foundation, we want to thank everyone for coming out today and supporting not only our teachers, but our kids, because that's why we're here, is, is to support kids. And so on behalf of the foundation, we want to thank Lakeside Links for hosting us this evening. I'm, I'm anxiously awaiting to see who that winner is. We've been blessed, that's for sure. So on behalf of everyone here at the foundation, thank you so much.